Now, since then, Ebola virus has made another 23 appearances on the planet, 20 of which were outbreaks in which it was transmitted from one person to another. And the total cumulative number of deaths there has been about less than 2,000. The outbreaks tended to be small, um, and they tended to burn out quick, quickly. Um, and doctors, after a while, got a sense of what I think was um, complacency. Uh, and there was a general consensus in the medical community that Ebola virus was not much of a threat and could be easily controlled. But nature has a way of surprising scientific people uh, with, um, uh, if you're a scientist and you make an assumption that isn't really based on sufficient data, nature has a way of completely surprising you. Now this recent outbreak began, uh, it seems, on about December 6, 2013, when a two-year-old boy in a small village called Meliandu in Guinea died of what we now know was Ebola virus. Uh, it was um, a type of Ebola that appears to be a little bit different than all the other Ebolas that have appeared. Um, later on, I'm going to talk a little bit about the genetics of viruses and about of Ebola. Uh, this particular Ebola um, began to move, and it left the village, and it moved jumping from person to person to person, setting up what are known as chains of infection. Now. When a virus is making a so-called trans-species jump into the human species from some host species, when a virus is attempting, so to speak, to turn the human species into a new host, um, uh, the, the, if you can talk about the goal of the virus, um, this is a little bit tricky because the organism does not have anything like a consciousness as we would describe it, and it has nothing like intention as we would talk of intention. But it, what it does have is biological sophistication. And it is set up genetically to be opportunistic. Uh, the goal of the virus is to set up uh, endless chains of infection in its new host, chains that are unbroken and never end. Uh, and in that sense, the virus, the, the, the virus which is making the trans species jump, which HIV did, uh, is making itself immortal in its new human species, its new host. Uh, 